We are up against Chal, Chalupa, if you will, who's bringing a very interesting team. Right off the bat, probably gonna want to start with the Grim Snarl. It's a really good thing that on this Metagross, we have a Bullet Punch, which is gonna come handy against the priority user. Umbreon is another good Pokemon to bring in, uh, bring in against the Grim Snarl. Um, I'm thinking based off his team setup, his Grim Snarl is going to be his screen user. Um, yeah, so I'm pretty confident he's gonna start with that screen user. Now, what do I wanna start with? You guys are probably gonna ask. Probably Lucario. But I really, really, really want the Metagross lead. And the reason behind that is because I can bullet punch this thing, you know, get a little priority on it. And that's basically why. So if you guys missed last Wi-Fi battle, again, it's your boy Daddy Mac. If you're new to the channel, what is going on? But if you guys missed the last Wi-Fi battle, we are bringing a brand new team. We also talked about a couple of updates on the channel that I'm very excited about. And then my water over there, I don't want to reach for it. But we got the Ferrothorn coming in, which is actually not what I was expecting. So he's probably gonna want to take some time to set up some spikes, stealth rocks, leech seeds, you name it. So we brought in Steven the Metagross. And we got nothing for this thing. So you already know right off the bat, we are going to get the hashtag out of there. And then just bring in Lucario. That's going to be our best bet. That is going to be the best bet. Okay, so we bring in the Lucar. All my Pokemon are in a Moon Ball. And I just realized I have no counters against, um, against uh, what's your name? Ferrothorn. And usually I do plan against Ferrothorn. I don't know why I did it in this case, to be honest. Um... Unfortunately, I don't have a defogger and I uh, actually Keldeo secret sword is gonna be good against the um, Gosh darn uh, what's your name? What's your name? I don't remember his name So I really want a power-up punch and the reason behind that let's say he stays in Then I get to go ahead and close combat next turn or if Gengar comes in I, I should be able to one hit KO it with oh actually I can't extreme speed on it. I'm an idiot I forgot semiforgetio, which means uh, it's kind of slang for I forgot. Okay, so Lucario probably gonna go down. Unfortunately, we're gonna close combat. Julian, if you're watching this, I'm sorry. Your 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 favorite Pokemon is about to go down to a Pharaoh, which is not common. Now he has two options because I, I I think Lucario can take one more. Yeah, actually, he's probably gonna let Pharaoh Thorn go down. Ferrothorn's kind of valuable at the same time, so if I were him, I would not. Now, if I'm packing Bullet Punch, which I'm not, he would probably be afraid of that. Okay, here comes the Gengar. Bring in the gang. Okay, part of me wanted to predict that, but I also wanted to take the Ferrothorn. If so, he gave me the opportunity to do so. So I'm gonna go ahead and just Meteor Mash here. We're gonna let Lucario go down. No need to overplay this. Okay, so Meteor Mash, we actually outspeed and he dodges. You don't know how much that uh, hurts. I'm a little salty. Just a little bit salty. Okay. So obviously, even though I'm a salt vest, I'm not bringing Metagross against this thing. That's just ridiculous of me to do. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna bring in the Umbreon. And you know what? I just realized I have a wish pass on this um, Umbreon. So we would have been okay in all reality. Unfortunately, we don't have much of an attacking movement with Umbreon, except for the foul play. So what I want to do is just wish because he might switch out here. And the reason I'm gonna wish is if I decide to stay in, I can just baton pass or actually protect and then just recover the health up. Or let's say that I want to switch out. I can take an attack from another Pokemon and then um, basically take stealth rock damage or whatever he's at and, um, and, and, and get my health back up. So that's why we're gonna go ahead and just wish it up and then we're gonna we're gonna have foul play here. Hopefully knock out the Gengar, though the chances are not very likely. So he's gonna go for the sledge wave. But I am a bulky Umbreon, special defensive Umbreon here. We should be able to take that easily. And then we foul play here. Boom! Doesn't knock out just like I thought it would not knock out. So that's kind of a that's kind of a shame. But I'm just gonna foul play again. I got nothing to lose going for a foul play, to be honest. Now, what we really don't want is assuming that his Flygon is Life Orb, I really don't want to risk a, a Dragon Dance. Because if he Dragon Dances, 
I'm kind of in a little bit of a bind. I'm in a big bind if he go, uh, goes in the dragon dance. I'm gonna reach for my water, sorry about this. I'm just really, really thirsty. I just had dinner and um, drank a lot of soda, which I really broke my rule because I don't drink soda on the weekdays. And I, I just feel dehydrated. Don't drink soda, kids. It's bad for you. Oh, that was disgusting, my apologies. <laughs> How have you guys been? Um, I like to ask that every single week. Not every single time we record, but every single time we um, we have a new video on a new week. So, how have you guys been? Let me know. Okay, so I really want to foul play here, though it's just not worth to me. So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to switch it up. We're going to go ahead and just bring in the gosh darn Metagross. So Steven the Metagross comes out. Shiny, beautiful Metagross. One of my shiny favorite, one of my favorite shiny Pokemon. So spike damage, hammer arm. So this is an attacking Grim Snarl. Now, the good news for us is that, well, I don't got the... He's going to switch out. I know that for a fact. And he's probably going to go Ferrothorn. I'm going to take this opportunity to double switch into the Keldeo. So I know you want to switch out, my boy. You want to bring in this... Um... I know you do. Come on, switch. Switch. I'll play. We're justified. We are justified. I will give him that. Unfortunately, though, boost attack and not, and not nothing else. So, doesn't really benefit me. So, we have two options because I am choice scarf. I can either a flip turn or secret sword. Um, I really want a secret sword. I'm free to go for a secret sword other than Charizard though. So, we're gonna take this Grim Snarl. I think that's the best play. Secret Sword probably won't knock out, but it does some significant amount of damage. Here comes a play rough and it hits. Yeah, because I was hoping for a miss. I really was. I'm not going to lie. And I'm playing like garbage with this team. This team was supposed to be pretty good. And now I have no Ferrothorn counters. So we're in trouble. In really big trouble. We're just going to Metagross again. And then honestly just take this thing. I played aggressive trying to predict a switch there. I should have honestly just hit him with something. I should have hit him with the Meteor Mash. That's what I should have done. I mean, we're going to Meteor Mash. Hope for a plus one. Well, even even if he goes Ferret Thorn, it's not going to make a difference. So, yeah. Yeah. The big, the biggest thing that mattered in this battle is uh, Lucario missing the attack on Gengar. That was huge. Because, let's say I do knock out the Gengar. Yes, I have Umbreon in the back. But if I knock out the Gengar, then Lucario had an opportunity to put some pressure on another Pokemon. So, even with extreme speed. And that's why I'm a little bit salty. But it is what it is, right? It's Pokemon. What are you going to do? What are you going to do? Okay, Flygon does come out. Just like we figured. And honestly, I'm just going to Meteor Mash. It's the strongest attack that I have. Unfortunately, it has a chance to miss. But, oh, Earth Power is a thing. I'm Assault Vest. Can we take? We can take. We can definitely take this. Um, I think we go down... Oh my goodness, Metagross! What is with Meteor Mash missing? That is the most redonkulous thing I've ever seen in my entire life. It's just not in the cards today. Okay, so we do about a quarter. Dragon Dance. Woo! That is scary. That is very scary. Now, I don't have any more priority other than the Bullet Punch, do I? I do not. Okay. We're gonna let Metagross go down. I'm gonna bullet punch again. He can dragon dance all he wants Honestly, I'm not too scared. I'm not too scared, especially if this is mixed earth power Yeah, because I would run if you were running dragon dance. I would I would run all physical attacks It's a good thing I went for the bullet punch um, Crobat is my next best option against this thing. Honestly, we can just brave bird Swamper can flip turn. So we're gonna go ahead and go into the Swamper here. We're a choice banded Swamper. And I believe we're 252 speed and HP. So that's gonna be good for us. Um flip turn. Should be able to take this flag on out. I'm banded adamant. Or no banded jo jolly, I think. Okay, so he U-turns, I U-turn. This is good. That's a lot of damage for a U-turn, not gonna lie. So now Baton Pass and Wish are gonna be my best friends here. I just gotta play smart that's all that's all i got to do if he goes into ferrothorn i am going to be a little bit upset 
because I have nothing to uh, counter his Ferrothorn. So, and then Ferrothorn has has body press from what it showed us. So, okay, here comes the Ferrothorn. I'm gonna bring in the Crobat. I think Crobat's gonna be our best bet against this thing, unfortunately. So, game is a flip turn. That does some pretty good amount of damage. Not gonna lie. No Rocky helmet, please. Okay, cool. So what I'm gonna do here, I'm just gonna bring in the crow. I really want to bring in the crow, man. I I do. I have to. I feel like I do at least. We're gonna crow back. This thing is not at. Okay, it is at half. So hopefully a life orb, brave bird will do the trick. We're that's why we're losing because we're not in home field advantage. That's why we're on the leaf gym, I think. Okay, brave bird knocks out. There you go, Crobat. That's what I'm talking about. So, Ferrothorn was actually one of the Pokemon I'm, I'm really afraid of. So, now we're in a little bit of a better spot because Flygon is afraid of Swampert. Charizard is definitely afraid of Swampert. And who's his third Pokemon? I, I'm pretty sure. Yeah, because I took out the Gengar. I took out Rotom as the other Pokemon. Um, we're obviously going to U turn here. I should outspeed because I'm Jolly. Unless this thing is Scarf, then we're in a little bit of trouble, but... Okay, it's not. Thank goodness. Thank goodness. We're just gonna go ahead and U-turn out of there. Lose some HP because of Life Orb. And again, Baton Pass Jolt Umbreon is gonna be our, our best bet. That's how we're gonna win this. That's how we're gonna win this. Thunderbolt, we should be able to take this. Easy. Easy money. Easy money. Okay. We're just gonna wish. We're gonna wish it. We're gonna wish upon a star. Hydro Pump comes out, which I'm okay with. I should be able to take this. Easy. We take these like champs. And honestly, we're just gonna foul play. Get some damage out on this Rotom. MVP is gonna go to Umbreon. I already know. I already know. He's the reason we're going to win this Wi-Fi battle. So, foul play. Rotom is going to take at least half of what he has right now. Electroweb. Ooh, fancy. Fancy stuff. I've never seen Electroweb Rotom outside of BGC. So, that's cool. All right, foul play. Hmm, I was wrong. I was definitely wrong. So, my wish comes true. And boom. What am I gonna do now, you may ask? Uh, the question's quite simple. I'm gonna I'm gonna go ahead and wish again, and then we're gonna baton pass. I want you to go for a thunderbolt, my friend. Okay, so he, he actually withdraws. Charizard comes out. Is this physical? Are you gonna Dynamax? I got a feeling he's gonna Dynamax. He's gonna pull that. I already know he's gonna pull that. Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and just foul play. I'm hoping it's a physical Charizard. Focus Blast. Woo! Okay, I was not expecting that. So I like that damage. I am, though, going to Baton Pass. He's faster than me. I'll take an attack, which is perfectly fine. And I should be able to take this. Again, I'm careful nature. I know it's super effective. And yeah, we take that easily. Okay. We're going to Baton Pass. And we're just going to go... Is my wish going to take into it? I didn't pay attention, did I? I did not. Okay, we're gonna swamp her. That's all. We're just gonna swamp her here. And then if we're coming to us, we don't get we don't get our wish. We'll switch it. We'll sack off the. Okay, yeah, I don't get it. Unfortunately, ah, oh, that's kind of um, misplay on my part. Misplay on my part. So I'm just gonna crow back here. Ah, oh, that's frustrating. You know what I should have done is wish and then baton pass. That's what I should have done because I think I went wish foul play and that's why I didn't. Yeah, that's right. Okay, um, a little bit of Wish Rust, just like the Clefairy I used the other day. That's fine. I'm okay with it. We take the word resisted that we're resisting that times four, so that's good. Um, we'll be able to take this out with the Brave Bird. We outspeed you, so. And if we bring Rotom in, I outspeed Rotom. We're good. Easy money. There you go. Brave Bird. Maybe Crobat's MVP. Who knows? That's his second knockout, I believe. I believe okay we lose some HP oh we won this I'm pretty sure we won this I just gotta play my cards right <laughs> because if I don't play my cards right then I'm in trouble 
because if Rotom comes out, okay. That's the that's the, this is best play to be honest, and that's fair. So I'm just gonna. What is he? He has one layer of spikes, right? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. So we're gonna go ahead and just Umbreon here. Okay. And we're in the air, so spikes does not phase us actually. So we're good. Because I'm gonna go into Umbreon. We're just gonna go ahead and wish it up. We are taking some damage, unfortunately. Electroweb is fine. Oh, we dodged that. You ain't need a Electroweb. You ain't gotta do that. This is a good battle. Well thought out. Well thought out. Okay, we're gonna go ahead and wish again. This is our third, fourth wish of the battle. It's in the stars tonight, boys. Oh, whoa, whoa. Why is my remote dirty? My controller. My controller. I've been trying to work on vocabulary. And uh, it's not, it hasn't been working out for me, unfortunately. Okay, so we're gonna wish if his, if his um, Flygon wants to go ahead and either Dynamax or Dragon Dance, that's fine. Because I'm gonna protect and I should be able to take an attack. Actually, we're just gonna foul play, especially if he Dragon Dances. Come on, I know you're gonna Dynamax. Woo! All these Dynamax users. And we still end up taking W's. Watch. We won't take a W. Okay. Big Flygon. Flygon's one of my favorite Pokemon for sure. Not very good, unfortunately. And then it didn't get a Mega Evolution, which is even even worse. Okay. Oh, we're going down, I think. Don't go down, Umbreon. Okay. That's what I'm talking about. Okay. So our wish is going to come true. Special attack goes down, which doesn't matter, to be honest. We're going to foul play. Hmm. That's unfortunate. That's highly unfortunate. So our wish comes true, which is great. We ain't complaining. And then honestly, do we foul play or wish? We wish protect. We're gonna stall this Dynamax out. You can flutter by again. We're gonna take this. Oh man, that's more damage than last time. Okay, so here's what we're gonna do. Yeah, I can't really sack anything off right now. We're gonna wish. And... The Swampert resists the bug type move. I'm pretty sure... No, we don't. We don't. So I, I feel like Swampert is my win con, though I think it's Umbreon. So we're gonna protect here and, wish, and hope for the best. I hope we can take this. This is last turn of Dynamax. We protect... And we shield the attack. I believe we take 25% of what we are we, we would normally take. I could be wrong, so don't quote me out of that. Oh, we're tanking that. Woo! Flygon ain't got anything on us, for real. Okay. Even if you got her Umbreon, you're an MVP, for sure. Easy stuff. Okay. And this is the last turn to Dynamax, so Flygon can kiss the sky goodbye. And all we gotta do is foul play these next two turns, and that's a W. You cannot get rid of my Umbreon. And surprisingly, I was able to get rid of his Ferrothorn. That was awesome. Okay, so U-turn. That's perfectly fine. We're just gonna go ahead and foul play. That was a smart play. U-turn is the smart play. Rotom the Rotom comes out. We'll be able to take any attack this thing wants to dish out on us. And then one more. One more foul play and that'll take that'll do the trick on this uh bro tom. Okay. Alright, Rotom. 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 Miss. You don't miss. Of course not. But I missed two meteor mash. That's cause that's fair, you know. Okay, foul play again. That's gonna take this thing out. And then um even I, I'm pretty sure. Yeah, we're gonna, we, we win it regardless because I got my Crobat in the back and it outspeeds everything. And you only got spikes, not self rock, so that's a W. We won. Surprisingly, we won. I thought we were gonna lose. I really did. Okay, flag on him once again, and we're just gonna foul play. Easy money! That was a, a really good battle. U turn, that's his best attack. We take it and we just foul play, and that's a good, that's good game. I'll play Umbreon. Can we take note about Umbreon? 
and I'm not running toxic as you guys can see so leave a like if you enjoyed that that was the litest thing of all litness whatever that means but yeah thank you so much for your battle um what's your name again uh chaloop Ch chow 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 thank you so much for that wi-fi battle never met the guy but that was really great if you guys enjoyed the battle make sure you leave a thumbs up it helps the algorithm and subscribe to my channel if you want to watch more wi-fi battles or just video games in general because keep an eye out for a video um either tomorrow or thursday don't know yet but it's gonna be a good one so leave a like i'll see you guys next time